Are you having money problems? Even though you're trying, are things not working out? Maybe you've wondered how rich people make a lot of money. The road to success can be tough, but it's exciting if you're committed. Reaching the top usually means facing challenges along the way. If it were easy, everyone would be rich, but that's not the case. To succeed in this journey, you have to face and overcome the obstacles ahead. The initial step is recognizing and mastering the factors hindering your financial progress. In this video, we'll look at the mistakes to avoid if you want to become very rich. These obstacles are inside you, everyday habits that might ruin your chances of success. Unless you realize this fact, your journey towards financial freedom might stay out of reach. Here are 12 things you must avoid if you want to be rich. Number 1. Overworking. Some people mistakenly believe that working tirelessly is the only way to get rich, leading them to work multiple jobs at once. Others suffer from a do-it-yourself mentality, unwilling to delegate tasks to others. But working too much is bad for both productivity and well-being. Wealthy individuals recognize the importance of delegation and collaboration, enabling them to achieve balance between work and leisure. Prioritizing time for family and friends fosters a harmonious life equilibrium. Taking breaks helps you relax and recharge, giving you the energy you need to keep succeeding. Number 2. Too much planning. Spending too much time planning might not be worth it in the end. People who accomplish big things often don't have detailed plans for every single step of their journey. Instead, they maintain clarity regarding their goals and possess unwavering confidence in their ability to succeed. Don't wait for the perfect moment to start your projects, as experience and knowledge come through practical engagement. Success comes to those who act decisively, not those who just wait for chances. Number 3. Living a Fake Life how real are your actions? Are you trying to show off wealth and success you don't really have? If you prioritize impressing others over remaining true to yourself, it poses a significant issue. Pretending to be someone you're not makes you shallow and stops you from growing. You're scared to admit your fake lifestyle because you don't want people to see the lies. It's important to stop pretending and just be real. Real people earn respect and trust, making it easier to connect and do business with others. Number 4. Procrastination. Procrastination means waiting too long to do what you need to do, usually causing problems and delays. It often begins with minor actions, such as neglecting to make your bed in the morning or skipping morning exercises. But if you keep doing this all the time, you might miss out on a lot of chances to change your life. To beat procrastination, get into the habit of doing things right away. Upon recognizing a promising opportunity, initiate action without delay. Even if you can't finish everything at once, just starting is really important. Whether it involves conducting online research for a project or visiting a potential real estate property, taking that initial step is crucial. Number 5. Criticizing others negatively. What do you do when you meet people who have a lot of money and success? When you encounter luxury vehicles like Rolls Royces or limousines, what thoughts arise? Do you find yourself frequently expressing grievances about the wealthy? Do you view them as a detriment to society? If you quickly judge what others achieve, it's important to watch how you think. You can't get rich if you're jealous of rich people. Always hating on rich people makes it harder for you to become rich yourself. You can only ascend to a status that you respect and admire. Number 6. Wrong Choice of Friends Consider the composition of your social circle. Who do you often hang out with in your free time? Are they inclined towards excessive drinking and partying? If your companions align with these behaviors, your prospects for financial success are likely diminished. It's important to think about who you spend time with and choose friends who have similar goals and beliefs as you do. Hanging out with the wrong people can stop you from reaching your dreams and make you miss out from pursuing investment opportunities. It's not always because they don't think you can succeed, sometimes they just don't want you to become more successful than them and leave their group of friends. They may fear losing your companionship once you attain wealth. If your aim is financial prosperity, now is the opportune moment to distance yourself from such associations. Number 7. Complacency. If you're making enough money now, 
You might think you don't need to try new things or learn new skills. However, have you considered the trajectory of your life a decade from now? Perhaps you're single at present, but in the future, you may have a family with increased financial responsibilities. Will your existing resources suffice to sustain the lifestyle you envision? Moreover, have you formulated contingency plans in case of job loss or unexpected financial challenges? Remaining within the confines of your comfort zone poses inherent risks. To aspire for wealth, you must venture beyond it, as stagnation inevitably leads to decline. Always strategize for the future, and invest in endeavors poised to yield substantial financial dividends down the line. Number 8. Poor Spending Habits How do you handle your money? Do you pay attention to every dollar you make or do you spend money carelessly? It's really important to keep track of how much money you earn and spend. Poor spending habits often result in recurrent financial shortages. Wealthy individuals demonstrate accountability in their financial management, a practice you must adopt to achieve similar success. Resist the temptation to indulge in every desire. Instead, establish priorities and ensure that your expenses remain below your income. This approach safeguards against debt accumulation and facilitates the accumulation of savings for future investment opportunities. Number 9. Fear Many people don't reach their full potential because they're scared of different things. These fears may include a fear of failure, a fear of success, a fear of rejection, or a fear of criticism. Wealthy individuals embrace failure as a learning opportunity, leveraging it to refine their understanding and approach. Instead of giving up when things go wrong, they get back up, learn from their mistakes, and keep going with new knowledge. Furthermore, Rich people focus on their goals more than what others think, and they keep going no matter what. To attain wealth, it's essential to confront and overcome these inhibiting fears. Number 10. Lack of mentorship. Do you believe that you're already an expert in everything, so you don't need seminars or books to learn more about what you want to achieve? This attitude reflects a know-it-all syndrome. Even if you're really passionate and determined, if you don't listen to other people and learn from them, you might have a hard time for a long while. It's really important to ask people who have been through the same things for advice. Even if what you're doing is not exactly the same as what they did, there should be a degree of relevance. It doesn't matter if your mentor is alive now or lived in the past, learn from them by reading their books, going to seminars, or direct interaction if feasible. Many successful people are happy to share what they know with eager learners. Number 11. Instant gratification. This concept is all about always wanting quick results from everything we do. While there may be valid reasons for this approach, such as urgent financial needs, it often leads to prolonged financial struggles for many individuals. Those who prioritize instant gratification frequently find themselves living paycheck to paycheck, unwilling to commit their efforts to ventures that require time to yield returns. In contrast, Affluent individuals prioritize long-term investments. They work hard now without worrying about getting quick rewards. Instead, they focus on giving something valuable rather than getting immediate praise. Their focus remains on achieving substantial long-term results. And number 12. A negative mindset. What type of mindset do you possess? Do you usually see problems in every idea or do you see potential? A negative mindset perceives a glass as half-empty, whereas a positive mindset views it as half-full. It's important to stop always seeing problems and start looking for opportunities instead. Even when faced with numerous reasons why something might fail, strive to find at least one reason why it could succeed. This adjustment may require time, especially if you've held on to limiting beliefs for an extended period. Remind yourself consistently, if someone else did it, I can do it too. Repeat this affirmation to yourself regularly, and gradually, you'll develop the confidence to recognize opportunities rather than obstacles. That concludes today's video. I hope it was informative and beneficial to you. If you found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up. I welcome your feedback, so feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Lastly, remember to subscribe and turn on notifications so that you don't miss any future videos. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.